So we have some new uh, posters, some good news. We're always trying to streamline things. And in the past, um, if you wanted to share our information with your doctor, we would ask you to fill out a form. And then we have um, these, these um, hard uh, cardstock card um, little uh, papers that you can take, uh, that we mail out to your doctor. They would be in um, the waiting room or he would give them out to people who had um, aortic disease so that you could connect with us. Well, that that's really expensive um, to do that. And, and it was really hard for us to keep up with after we sent all of these out over the years, trying to keep up with which doctors, you know, gave them out and need more, which doctors, um, you know, didn't give them out. And so we shouldn't send them anymore. Um, so we've streamlined it. And I love this. We've done a couple of things here. Um, so what we have, we launched the patient awareness posters, and you can see a picture of it right here. It's very similar to the um, cart, the, the table side cards. We still have those available, but this is streamlining it. So the patient awareness poster can be um, mailed to you. I think it's in packs of 10. So they would be mailed out to you for you to take um, I don't know if you belong to the YMCA and you want to, you know, you want to put one up there, um, take to your doctors, take to your community buildings and tack them up. Um, you can make copies of them. You can keep a copy for yourself so that, you know, make sure your doctors all have them in, in their, um, in their waiting rooms, in their patient rooms. But on there are the, um, QR codes that all you have to do is take a picture and it will take you right to our different community groups that you might be looking for. And um, I think this is so great. This is not only going to save us some money and money that we can put back into the community, but um, it's the more we can get um, people connected once they've experienced it in either a dissection or an aneurysm or whatever aortic um, disease they're dealing with, this is so wonderful to be um, a better way of getting in touch with people. So there's a form that you fill out. Please, 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 as somebody who addresses things all the time for people, please leave your entire correct address. Please look at it before you you know, push send. I can't tell you many times um, I send out about 30 pieces of mail a, a, a month. And I can't tell you many times I have to go look up the um, zip code because people don't put it in there or they'll only give me their street address and their state. And I don't know what, or they're not the, st the street address and the um, town. And I don't know what state it is. Then I have to go Google that. So anytime you fill out any of our forms, please, please, please take a moment and make sure that it's completely correct. Um, but we want to get these out in your hands. So fill out those forms and we'll get them out as soon as possible. After you spread them around your community, make sure that you keep one for yourself so that you can take um, you have the copy, your your one hard copy. Um, and then when you go to your doctors every six months or once a year, say, hey, you know, can I update you, you know, if, if we've changed it or anything and give them a new copy.